So, uh, Pat, you want to start? Um. So you're you're a Big Bang Theory buff, I know. Me? Oh yes. Yeah, you are. You're the oh, one. Yeah, I know. You're the mind behind the Big Bang Halo, after all. Uh, right. <laughs> you know everything about the Big Bang Theory. Right. Yeah. So we're this gonna see. True. We're gonna see who who actually knows more about the Big Bang Theory. Someone yep. like me, yep, who's hardly ever watched it, or someone mm -hmm. like you who has seen every episode several times. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> so let's yeah. yes. see. All these things are true. Okay. Who's Sheldon's favorite actress out of all the different actresses who have played Catwoman? All right, so he looks, he looks kind of like he you he knows that you know the answer. <laughs> <laughs> he he's expecting the right one. He's just like you do know this, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yep. Um. So all right, so I have two thoughts. It's definitely not Anne Hathaway. I mean, come on. I'm I'm choosing Anne Hathaway because she's my she's cool. I like her. No, oh. way. it can't. Be. It cannot be. It's either okay. So it's. Uh, Halle Berry is like an easy choice, but I think Julie Newmar is like the hipster and like probably like just more like racist choice. And I think that's important. <laughs> that's that's kind of a more Big Bang Theory move. Um, so I'm gonna go with that, and I was correct. Okay, sick. So <laughs> which oh, it was Julie it Newmar. Julie Newmar. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <That's laughs> I was just like, that's the more hip hipster and. Slightly racist choice, so I'm gonna go with that. Okay. Uh, okay. Leonard's father gave him the middle name Leaky, honoring what famous archaeologist? Oh my god, I have to type it in. Are you? Kidding? I I I know this one like the back of my throat. It's Leaky what? Larry. It's Leaky Larry. Come on. It's Leaky Larry. Everyone knows Leaky Larry. Um. Guess. Okay. Guess. Uh, it'll it'll let me keep guessing. No, I'll click. I give up. Uh, I think it's, uh, I'm going to go with, Drake, it's got to be alliterative. Washed over there. I'm sorry, what? It's got to be an alliterative name. So I'm going to go with, uh, Leaky uh, Larry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go with, uh, I'm going to go with, uh, um, Lou, Lou Leaky. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, wait, can I keep guessing? Uh, yeah. I, I don't know how you would uh, get this. You, you were pretty close, so I'll just... I'll, it tells you what it is when you click I give up. It's Louis Lou Leaky. So you, is you it really? It. Yeah, you got it. You, oh my god. You did it. Congratulations. Oh my god. Drake's looking a little washed, but congratulations. Drake what? <laughs> don't worry, it'll, it'll come out better in the video. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You'll see it. You'll... What Apple creation would have been signed oh. by Steve Wozniak if Sheldon had made it to the restaurant? It had made it to the restaurant with it. What? I know for one that I could never leave ho leave home without my Apple color plotter. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's got to be a printer, right? The color plotter. Yeah. I I don't know. <laughs> I can't leave color. home without it, though. It's gonna be a colored printer. Um, um, I'm I'm gonna go with the Apple II Plus. Oh no! <laughs> My streak. Yeah. Oh My man, streak is broken. That's okay. That's okay. Cause like they're similar. So like I. You know, of course it wasn't the Apple II Plus. Of course yeah. it was just the normal Apple II. Yeah, they're uh, similar. So, like, no. obviously, a veteran, even a veteran of the Big Bang Theory like you can get that, <laughs> can get that a little, a little rusty. I can't believe I'm actually, like, doing halfway hour into this. <laughs> okay, uh, what language is Howard teaching Sheldon in the last episode of Season oh, 1? Dude, it's... Oh, last episode of Season 1? It's, um, oh, it's, season. it's clearly, um, Dova.
Japanese. Oh my god. I so I guess uh I guess uh uh I guess Klingon and Yiddish. <laughs> oh my god. And neither were correct. Uh I guessed um Dova and Japanese. Uh-huh. And neither were correct. How about it, I bet did it's like you give up? Doth it is it like Dothraki? I don't know how to no, spell that. Did it, you but... wait, did you did you give up yet? I give up. Man no, you should Mandarin? Have, uh, yeah, you shouldn't have you shouldn't have given up. I would have I would have given you some hints so you could try to get it. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Um, we'll do that for the well. next next guessing yeah. one. Um in the university's cafeteria, what food did Howard say tasted like ground up shoemaker? Ground up shoemaker. Easy. <laughs> Done deal. Um uh beans. I'm gonna type uh, lettuce in all caps. Alright, don't don't give up. Uh, I'm, okay. gonna, I'm, <laughs> You're gonna, I'm gonna give you have the, me guess. You're gonna help GGD out this answer. not veteran? Yes. Okay. Um give me a hint. So throw one my way. Uh, it's a play on words. Play on words. It's a no. It's a <sighs> it's a clever uh it, it's a typical clever uh Big Bang Theory joke. It's right up their street. You know, it's very it's very highbrow, it's very like you know brisket. It's not, it's not easy. Is it brisket? It's not brisket. <laughs> That's the one thing I remember is that he always eats like I don't know he talks about brisket in the one part of the one episode I saw. No, what's the other? Okay, what to play on words with shoemaker? Ground beef. No, not don't don't focus on the ground up part. Okay, Just focus on shoemaker. Shoemaker. Yes. Is this something racist? No. <laughs> uh, I give up. No. Cobbler. No. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. All right, what was Leonard's dog's name? <laughs> It was Mitzi. Oh, I got it right. Oh my god. <laughs> I got it right. Oh my god. I'm sorry I spoiled it for you, but I was just surprised. I mean, yeah, I mean I, I kinda knew that one. Like, let's be honest. It was Mitzi, Mitzi is a classic character. Oh yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, I forgot you were the veteran. Okay, when when uh Okay. Did you forget his when, name? <laughs> you know that's when, right. It's right here. When right Sheldon here. goes into a movie theater, how does he pick which seat to sit in? He blank <laughs> until he finds the blank spot. I know oh. the answer to this. I know the answer to this. Um. So you you go for it. All right. I'm I'm, I'm gonna. I I know the answer. Just I already got it. So. It's this is all on you. I feel like humming would be up his alley, but the great spot doesn't sound correct. Like Yes. Yes. You're, so, on, a good, you're on the good path. So, and I don't see him ever laughing. So uh it's gonna have to be a number two. Nope. No, he laughs until he finds the acoustic sweet spot, dude. So, so does he just go like with every movie like he's in a horror movie he and he laughs acting. in every scene? Well, and moves he around. Gets there, he gets there before the movie starts, obviously. Gotcha. So okay. Gets, and he moves around and he's like, ha! Ha! He finds. The That's acoustic. hardly a laugh. <laughs> Whatever. That's hardly a laugh. Whatever. Okay, what is okay. Bernadette's father's former profession? This one's an easy one. Look at his mustache. That's all you need. He was a chef. <laughs> he's got the Coke can in his hand. <laughs> no, army, navy, police, army, police. It was police. Look at the mustache. It's like obviously police. 
How is that? Dude, that's mustachially profiling. Um. Okay. Penny's father is referred to by what two names? Uh. Shane and Bob. Oh my god, I got it. Uh. Oh god. <laughs> Shane and Wyatt. I'll give you a hint. Burger King foot. <laughs> the last thing you'd want in your Burger King George burger is someone... George and Shane. It was Bob and Wyatt. Um, I was wrong. Uh, yeah, it was Bob and Wyatt. Okay. And I actually got that right. Um, when Barry Kripke doesn't think that Penny's oh name. We, no, we need to stop this. We need to stop <laughs> this right now. All right, um, then do you want to read? I'll, I'll read a word and then you read a word. Yeah, that works very well. When? When? Oh. oh shit. Okay, ready? <laughs> Three, two, one. When? Barry. Kripke. <laughs> <laughs> this this one could be its own video. We're at like okay. sixteen minutes. Three <laughs> <laughs> And we're not even halfway done. Three, two, one. Kripke doesn't think that anything is going to be color. Any, uh, what's Roxanne? You know, as a banana, where did everything get out of the way? When you left him, when you left him, wait, you went too fast. What are you, I said, I did not have Mars. I did not have him. Wait, you went to the planet? Wait, I said, I'm not obviously. I'm the one who was talking about that. 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 I'm I was wrong. It's Romulan. What name did Raj? This quiz is so long. Oh my god, this quiz is so it's, long. It's it's really long. Why are you going this so is fast? So long because it's so long. We Why? need to move on. We don't we need, to, need move to move on. We, we just need to get to a different the quiz. The power of editing. I guess so. <laughs> the power of editing. This quiz. All right, let's just take it up from when Penny asked the question, Tweety Bird, whatever, or what name do Raj and Howard give to a cricket they captured to settle a bet? Scorpion. Drake is washed. All right, next quiz. <laughs> next, Perfect. Next quiz. We did right. it. We Will finished. you live in a mansion or a shack? Answer these random questions to find out. I really like how the description is mansion or shack. That's like a it, good it description. That's I mean, a it doesn't really one. add anything. Um, oh, brownie or ice cream? Oh. That's so hard. I mean, I think just because it's like 100 degrees where I am right now, oh, I'm going to go with ice you. cream. <laughs> Me too. And I feel like it's hard. It's it's harder to mess up ice cream. True. That's very it's, true. It's it's way easier to mess up brownies. Yeah, I've had bad brownies. Yeah. Um, although those brownies do look really good. And I think <sighs> that if you were to put some ice cream on top of that brownie. Yeah. Then you'd be in in yeah. business. Yeah, especially. Oh that no! Yeah, this. So I've I've pizza. recently dis I've recently discovered a newfound love for mac and cheese. Um, oh yeah. And uh, I mean, I'm still gonna have to go with the OG. I mean, yeah, pizza yeah, yeah. is just pizza, like pizza. Yeah, pizza was there before Tupac. That's. <laughs> what? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, OG? I think you're right. All right, this one's easy. Uh, <laughs> This one's really easy because peanut butter is uh, for toddlers. <laughs> what? But it's like raisin cookies. No, they're not. Look closely. They're like Those raisins. Those are big old chocolate chunks. Those are big old chiplity chunkos. I'm going to go based on fine the fact that they're butter. and choose Fine butter. peanut butter. You don't I have to you... change your No, answer. you know You know what? You know what? What? Fine. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Uh, this one, uh, th pater, this pater one's tots or fries. Fries are like duh. I love fries. What? No, dude, tater tots are well, better. Tater tots, tater tots are like they're good sometimes, but like other times they're just like kind of grainy and dry and weird. Yeah, but I'd rather have them be grainy and dry than like long and uncooked and not like not hard, like like really gross and soft. Dude, I you gotta have a good you gotta have better fries. What is this? Um, we already had the pizza. Dude, uh it's it's never a bad time for pizza. 
Okay, yeah, pizza again. Wait, 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 hold on, hold what? on. Hold on a minute. Pizza hold versus spaghetti? So wait, okay, so we had brownie versus ice cream, pizza versus mac and cheese, cookie versus peanut butter, french fry versus tater tots. This is all making sense. Pizza versus spaghetti. Is this all based on the, the author's opinionated view of which food is eaten by which class of people? Yes! Well, um, I'm noticing something on the side here that I think we might have to add a add a quiz. Oh, is that so? What are you what are you what are you seeing here? <laughs> Pick seven of your favorite foods and we'll reveal your secret fetish. <laughs> oh, good lord! I mean, all right. Well, we've uh, already we'll got. Add it, we'll add it to the end. We'll add it to the all end. All right. Sharks, sharks versus raccoons. Who who do, who wins in a fight? Who like? Do you, who wait, what are we picking though? Are we picking? Let's, because they didn't come up with the rule. Are we picking That's which right. one we like more? Are we picking which one we think would win in a fight against each other? Are we picking like, um, which one scares us more? Like what? Like what are we doing here? Uh, I think we're gonna. I think we're. I think we're just picking a favorite. All right, raccoon. Uh, I'm going shark. Uh, and then, uh, and then on the next one, raccoon versus baby. I'm going raccoon because the raccoon would claw its little dumb eyes out. Um, <laughs> and then, fair enough, sure. And yeah. then, um, uh, baby versus spaghetti. I'm going spaghetti. I would never eat a baby. I, that's right. I'm putting that on record in this video right yep. now. Very good. Stopping Take the rumors. Of, Take that out of context. <laughs> Stopping the rumors um, here. I would never eat a baby. Uh, all right, I'm gonna pick spaghetti over raccoons because I think the spaghetti would be able to claw its little eyes out. Like, what is this? Um, oh, high class spaghetti, or you're just a lowly raccoon eater person. That's right. Like, that's right. I'm choosing raccoon because uh, my boy Rocket Raccoon is in the Avengers. No. Baby versus shark. Which one of these adds a point to Shaq, and which one of these adds a point to Mansion? Um, dude. Everything adds a point to Shaq, because Shaq is just racking up points all day long. <laughs> uh, it's easy. Okay, I got my results. I also got my results. I got Shaq. I also got Shaq. Also, there's a, uh, there's a moth. I in hit it. In the Shaq? Not in the shack, in my, in my hell, in my... <laughs> Your personal hell that yeah. the triangle keeps you locked up in for when it's time for you to make a video? That's right. <laughs> yeah, precisely. Um, all right, you're going to the shack, but it's a very peaceful, nice shack in a scenic area where no one will bother you. That sounds Thank better you, than son. a mansion. Thank this? God.